All right, it's day number 15 in our journey here of the Best Easy Work Relaunch. So today I'm starting out with the number 10 traffic source that I want you to take a look at. So really at a very midpoint here and getting towards our journey, and this is going to be a special um, traffic source that I'm going to show you to, in a sense, hallmark the reaching of the midpoint in this journey. So the traffic source I want to expose you to is a traffic source that I've used for quite some time. It's one of my favorites because it has quite a bit of potential that you could use it for. And it can replace a lot of the stuff that you're doing in terms of some of those other traffic sources that I've shown you before. This traffic source that I'm going to mention to you, I'm actually going to show you right here, is traffic source number 10. It's called IBO Toolbox. And I know there might be a, quite a few people who have heard about IBO Toolbox. They probably even used IBO Toolbox. It was totally, you know, um, something that they didn't quite grasp what they had. So today I'm going to expose my traffic um, ideal toolboxes, how to kind of use it very well, and then let you get on your way to just go ahead and use in this uh, traffic source. So as always, you know how to get to it. In the action step in the description box below, you'll see a link that gives you access or gets you over to the traffic, uh, traffic source so you can get yourself signed up and get started. I should mention that ideal toolbox, it is a free source that you could actually use. It also has some different things. Of course, you know what? Let me go over to it and I'll explain to you how this thing works and show you what you're able to do with it. So when you get to this page here, you're going to get to Ideal Toolbox. So this is Ideal Toolbox here. And let's make sure that is nice and well for you. So this is Ideal Toolbox. This is the page you're going to get to. Um, when you come here, all you got to do is just create a new account. So it's pretty simple to do. Create, Put your first and last name in your email address. And with this email address, you could actually use your good email because they do send us some good information that you probably want to keep on top of. Um, so something to keep in mind of. So you could certainly use your good email. Of course, you could change it later on. Um, but you know, if you use your good email, you get some good information that you could act on. Now, once you sign up, um, you're going to get to the back office. So it's a pretty simple process. You sign up, you get to the back office. The first thing you want to do is going to be to edit your profile. The reason being you want to edit your profile, and let's come down here, is by editing your profile and creating a profile on the platform, you're going to earn your first 500 credits that you could use to advertise. And these credits are things you want to get. You want to get as much credits as you can get. Now, the difference between IBO Toolbox and some of the other platforms I've explained about is IBO Toolbox doesn't require you to click for links. So you don't have to come on here for 30, you know, an hour at a time, two hours to click for links to get enough credits to advertise. You could earn credits because they send out links every day that allows you to earn credits um, by, I'll show you how you earn credits, but it's a simpler process to earn your credits. So this is why this platform is one of my favorites. It's a really simple way to earn the credits and use them. And also on the platform here, it's just full of, entrepreneurs, business-minded people from all over the globe. Um, you can target people in all, you know, it's just a super neat platform to be on and advertise on, as you could, as I'm going to show you too. I kind of think of this as like Facebook for marketers in a sense, in the sense that, you know, you can come here and just start advertising. You don't have to, um, like on Facebook, you have to probably gain someone's, um, you know, friendship and try and see if you could talk with them and engage them in a conversation. On this platform, you could literally just come here and straight out start advertising to folks on the platform. So what you want to do when you sign up is you definitely edit your profile and you just click on edit. And when you click on edit, what's going to happen is it's going to bring up this page here. So you're able to put your, you know, edit all the details here. Um, phone number you can put there, your email address, or whatever information you want to put there. And when you complete all that stuff, and you want to put your pro picture profile, um, it will show you on the platform. So it just makes you more engaging on the platform. And so these are all required fields. You know, this part up here where you got to put all this information in here, it's pretty much required. You can see this one is optional. The PayPal email is optional. Um, these things are optional, but they want you to put in some basic information here so you can fill out your profile and you can put um, an image and it says required here, but the rest you know, step number three on down, you don't have to. You do want to, you know, put as much information on here as you can because that allows people to reach you. So, you know, this is business information. If you're going to advertise a business, you probably want to put your your link on here so when people click on your profile, 
they could get to your business link. But of course, you don't have to do that if all you plan to do is just come on the platform and advertise. So let's get in to the back office. This is going to be the exciting part where I show you some cool things back here. So you created your um, profile. Now when you create your profile, this is where you'll see your credits that you've earned your credits. So remember, by creating your profile, right, you get to earn 500 credits. Now you could earn credits a whole bunch of different ways, but as a new member, when you first sign up, create your profile, you get 500 credits for doing pretty much not much, just creating your profile, which is something that you want to do anyway. So you'll see your credits at the very top here. And Again, all you got to do is come here, edit your profile, then you'll get your 500 credits. Then the dashboard, I'm going to just orient you to the dashboard here. Now this is the wall where you're able to post things. Now you don't want to spam it, right? You don't want to just keep posting your links out here because you're going to be known as a spammer out here and people are not going to take you seriously and you just won't get any traction. So you want to post on the wall strategically. Probably different things, engage in things and get people in a sense to click on your um, profile and that's why you need to fill out all this detail right because if you fill out your profile and people are clicking on your um, your profile details then of course they'll eventually get to your business so that's a neat way to get people oriented to your business so that's one technique there you post on the wall engage in things and people click on your profile or you can post about your business but do it in an engaging way that is giving people information first and then they could click on it if they want now you'll notice as you know you look on the board here, you'll see these member advertising. That's what you're able to get. You're able to post ads in this area, and I'm going to show you how to do that. You're also able to post ads, uh, you know, banner ads that people will definitely see, right? I mean, look how engaging this is. It's just right smack in the middle of these um, people talking. But the cool thing I want you to take note of is you're able to post big banners at the very top. So everyone who logs onto the platform will get to see your banner, which this is a position that I recommend people strive to get. Get as much credits as you can and try and get in these positions. You can certainly post your ads here, right? It's going to get traction, but guess what? Everyone has to see this, right? You see how I had to scroll down to get to this side, but you know what? No one could avoid seeing these big um, banners at the top. So let me show you how to go post it, and then you know what? I'll let you get to the platform. So the first thing, of course, you edit your, your profile, you got your 500 points, now you're able to go advertise. Now to go advertise, all you got to do is create new. Now to create um, an ad, you just create new and it brings up this box. So it says, okay, what kind of ad do you want to create? You want to create a text ad, and like I mentioned, the text ad is these ads on the side here, right? So those are the text ads, or you could create, let's show you banner ads and like I mentioned the banner ads and let me show you again you could create banner ads that are 468 by 60 and then there's 250 by 250 728 by 90 now the 728 by 90 now that's what I was talking about these big ones at the top that's the ones you really want to go out after but as you see it costs like 10 impressions so every time this appears you're going to be deducted 10 of your um, your credits to host those. So that's why you want to get as much credit as you can because this will allow you to, you know, really be in that top spot. But of course, you could do any of these. I'm going to show you how that works. And, you know, the 468 by 60 banner, which is the smaller one down here that gets posted throughout the thread, those are the 468 by 60. So those are the ads you could post. Now, the post one, you hit the button, create new. And then it allows you to give it a name. So you can call it whatever you want. Let's say BEW. That's your first ad. Then the text title. I could put work from home with me. Of course you're going to put an engaging title, right? And this makes people money, right? And your website link. Of course you want to put, you know, the link to your website or whatever you're featuring. And like I've been, you know, mentioning throughout our journey here this is you know my lead capture page that I post on site so I use a lead capture page you could advertise your company you know whatever page you want to advertise I have advertised a lead capture page in my system so I can paste it there that's it you can leave it on default default means that it just goes in a normal paste or you could say give me fast traffic and then it rotates a lot more and then you could tell it where you want to put it so it could appear in the iBuild toolbox on the sides here 
And keep in mind, this platform has a whole lot more, let me say, partner websites that they advertise on. So not just IBO Toolbox, there's different places that your ads could be shown throughout the network of advertising sources. So this is where you get to post at different places. Now you could decide to pick one or pick all of them. Doesn't matter. So I'm going to pick this platform here, the IBO Toolbox, and all I'm going to do is hit Save Ad. Now when I hit Save Ad, it saved it. Now I can go check under my advertising and then you'll see that I created a BEW number one and under so, so there it is that's where it's showing up so that's as easy as it is to advertise so once you have it on what you want to do is turn it on but of course you have to have the credits right and then you change them into impressions and then that's where you turn it on and you get credits so I'm going to change out some credits. So you want to convert some of your credits into impressions. So I'm going to go ahead and hit convert. And when I hit convert, it's going to ask me how much I want to convert. So it says credits to convert. So based on how many credits you have, you can convert them. So let's say I want to convert, say, 100 credits. It tells me I can get 500 impressions. And I convert the credits. And it says now proceed to your ads. All right. Let's go to the ad and then I can turn it on so you can see it. So I've converted, my, and you can see I have 500 impressions here. So based on the credits, you get impressions. And now I can go turn this baby on. So when I turn it on, now as this shows my ad, it's going to deduct it from the impressions. And then you can turn it off, and you can edit it, and you know preview it. So this is my preview of what the ad looks like. And this ad will go along the side here, right, in the um, advertising text places. But let me show you like a 728 by 90 that I put on the platform. You can see this is something that I created and put on the platform. And this shows smack up at the very top. Now can you imagine people are coming here seeing the smack at the top, right? And get engaged. So that's what you want to do. Create these ads that you're able to put at the top. Or banner ads. And you can see that this is my banner ads. I got over 2,000 views, right? I got 162 clicks like 8% conversion on that. That means 162 people literally clicked on my banner to see where it goes and to see what I'm offering. The same thing with my listing to you. You, could, you will get to be able to see how your listings are doing. It will show you how many views you're getting, how many clicks you're getting on your ad and the conversion. Now, all the other platforms I showed you had did not really have this kind of power and capability of showing you how your ads are doing, right? You just advertise and you get traffic and we see how things are going. This literally shows you the traffic you're getting, the views you're getting, and how you convert it. So you know what that means? This allows you to tweak things, change things, mix it up a bit in order to see if you get better, better conversions on how of your advertising. So this is a great benchmark for you to use the this, this system here and gauge how your ads are doing. So this is where I go to, to test my ads, right, to see what's the reaction people are having to it is it powerful is it functional is it working are people you know engaging in my um my ad is this a good ad copy that i got so if you're wondering you know i don't know if my ad is really worded nicely i wonder how people are clicking on it or i wonder how it's going this is the platform you come to kind of test out those kind of things so enough on that because there's a lot here the thing you want to do is you know definitely dive into this platform and, and learn it like everything else that I've showed you, it involves you actually participating. There's no way anyone could show you everything about something and tell you everything about something because it won't be meaningful that you learn it in order to implement it in your business. So I've given you the overview. Now, you know, you just go out there, you know, take what I've given you right now to start advertising on the platform. But definitely, you know, learn more about the platform so you can use it better. Now one last final thing, I want to show you how you can earn more credits. You want to go to the credit center to earn credits. So this is how you earn more credits after you've done your profile and you got your 500 points. Under the credit center, it's going to allow you to earn credits. And you can see there's many different ways you can earn credits. So just go ahead and read through that. But let me quickly show you how you earn credits. Every day you're going to get a bonus code. All you got to do is copy this bonus code right here. So this is the daily bonus code. Copy it, hit redeem right here. When it says redeem, you're going to click in that box, paste it, but they want you to visit a member's, um, say a member's ad in order to get credits. So you just go, click the button here, you know, click on one of these sites, 
it's going to open a new window come down here click on a person